Also tonight, new developments in a weekend shootout between a man and police in Norfolk. And one of the suspects in the case appeared in court this morning. It comes as the Navy sailor shot by police on Arcadia Street. 29 year old Samuel Burton remains in the hospital. The officer's shot is in good condition, and tonight we're hearing from his family. Then your side's Kiana Patterson has the latest for us tonight. Arcadia Street is quiet now, but just two days ago, this entire area was blocked off after a police officer was shot several times. Officer Sean Blackwell is at home recovering after he was shot twice on Saturday on Arcadia Street while assisting CPS with an investigation. The initial shock, though, hearing those words. Yes. And shot. You, you know the visual that you get. His uncle, Pastor Joseph Casper, talked with him earlier that day about providing security during a youth event at Bethel Baptist. I got a call that he had been shot. And I said, oh my God. After learning Blackwell, a beloved school resource officer at Ruffner Middle and Booker T. Washington High, was shot in the arm and leg, this community sent an outpouring of support. When things happen, I go in prayer and talk to the Lord and just praying and hoping and trusting that things would come out well, which so far it has. He's doing well, he's home. Now this couple is praying for those facing charges. 29-year-old Samuel Burton is in the hospital after officers returned shots. He is facing a long list of charges. Navy officials confirmed he was stationed with Marmac in Norfolk. That somehow, some way, and, and through the might of Almighty God and his power, that he would touch them and bring them to the light of day. 23-year-old Cassandra Smith was in court this morning where a judge said she will not be released on bond given the nature of the charges. Court documents show she's a disabled veteran here with her spouse and child. I'm just grateful that things did not turn out like it could have. And neighbors out here tell me that they are concerned about the child that was involved. We're working to get more information on where that child is. In Norfolk, Kiana Patterson, to your side. And we will keep tabs on this story and post any updates for you as we get them on wavy.com.